it is not as if. Tell the children the truth. Babylon System by Bob Marley. It is not as if I have not been thinking this. And it is not as if we have not been thinking this. For what I mean when I will say whiteness, when I will say white people, when I say the whites with such seeming assurance, with such total confidence in the clarity of this locution, as if we all know the etymology of this word's genealogy, the lie of a cluster of marauding nations building kingdoms by destroying kingdoms. We have heard it all before, O Babylon. So yes, when I say this, what I mean is Babylon, as the Rastas have constructed the notion in the way of generosity, in the way of judgment, in the way of naming the enemy of history for who he is, in the inadequate way of symbols, in the way of the Bible's total disregard for history and the prophet's dance and the fulcrum of history leaping over time and place, returning to the place where we began having learned nothing and yet having learned everything language offers us. It is not as if I have not been thinking this. It is not as if we have not been thinking this. And I want to rehearse Jefferson and the pragmatism of cost, the wisdom of his loyalty to his family's wealth, the seat of the landed aristocrats reinvented on the plains of the new world, the coat of arms, the courtly ambitions, the inventions, the art, the bottles of wine, the French tongue, the legacy, the faux Roman, faux Greek pretension, the envy of the nobility of native confederacies, their tongues of fire, the land, the land, the land, and the property of black bodies. So much to give up. And who bears the sacrifice? Who pays the cost for the preservation of a nation's ambitions? How he said no to freeing the bodies he said were indebted to him for their every breath, the calculus of property. Oh, the rituals of flesh mongering, the protection of white freedom. It is not as if I have not been thinking this. It is not as if we have not been thinking this. And Bartolome de las Casas, Bishop of Chiapas, and his Memorial de Remedios para las Indias, the pragmatic use of Africans, the ones to carry the burdens of saving the Indians, to save the white man's soul. This little bishop of pragmatic calculation, correcting sins with more sins. And the bodies of black slave women, their wombs studied, tested, reshaped, probed, pierced, tortured with the whispered promise, it will help you too, it really will, and you will be praised for teaching us how to save the wombs of white women for the cause, all for the cause. And Roosevelt and his unfinished revolution, oh, Dream deferred, oh Langston, you tried to sing how long, not long, how long, so long. And Churchill's rising rhetoric saying that though cousin Nazis may ritualize the ancient blood feuds by invading Britain, her worldwide empire will rise up and pay the price for protecting the kingdom, the realm, liberty, and so on and so forth. Everyone so merciful, everyone so wounded with guilt and gratitude, everyone so pragmatic. It is what I'm saying, that I'm saying nothing new. And what I'm singing is, Babylon, your throne, gone down, gone down. Babylon, your throne, gone down. It is not as if I have not been thinking this. It is not as if we have not been thinking this. For no one is blessed with blindness here. 
No one is blessed with deafness here. And this thing we see is lurking inside the soft alarm of white people who know that they are watching a slow magical act of erasure and they know that this is how terror manifests itself quietly, reasonably, and with deadly intent. They are letting black people die. They are letting black people die in America. Hidden inside the maw of these hearts is the sharp pragmatism of the desperate. The writers of the myth of survival of the fittest or the order of the universe of platonic logic, the caste system, the war of the worlds. They are letting black people die. It is not as if I've not been thinking this. No. It is not as if we have not been thinking this. And someone is saying in that soft Midwestern voice of calm, well, there will be costs, and those are the costs of our liberty. Remember when the sent returned, and the prophets and the pontificators declared that in 50 years the nation would be brown, and for a decade the rogue people sought to halt this with guns with terror, with the shutting of borders. Now this has arrived, a kind of gift. Let them die. The blacks, the poor, the ones who multiply like flies, let them die. And soon we will be lily white again. Do you think I'm paranoid? I am. It is not as if I haven't been thinking this. It's not as if we have not been thinking this. And paranoia is how we've survived. So we must march in the streets, force the black people who are immigrant nurses, who are meat packers, who are street cleaners, who are short order cooks, who are the dregs of society, who are black, who are black, who are black, who are black, let them die. Here in Nebraska, our governor would not release the racial numbers. He says there's no need to cause strife. This is not our problem, he says. We are better than this, he says. It is not, it is not as if I have not been thinking this. It is not as if we have not been thinking this. And so, in the silence, we do not know what the purgation is. And here in this stumbling prose of mine, this blunt prose of mine, in the thing I have not yet said, they are trying to kill us. They are trying to kill us. They are trying to kill us off. I sip my comfort. The dead prophet, his voice broken by cancer, his psalm rises over the darkening plains. And then the sweetest act of pure resistance. Spread out. Spread out. Spread out. We are more than sand on the seashore. So we will not get jumpy, we won't get bumpy, and we won't walk away. Spread out. They sing in four-part harmony. Spread out. Spread out. Spread out. It is not as if I have not been thinking this. And it's not as if we have not been thinking this. It is how we survived and how we will continue to survive. But don't be fooled. These are the betrayals that are gathering over the hills. Help me, I say. Help me to see this as something else. It is not as if I have not been thinking this. See, it is not as if We've not all been thinking this. By Kwame Dawes. Summer 
2020.